and we're back after a couple of days out um, with life and stuff. And what an epic hold by Septiana. Huge fight, fantastic outcome. I've just spotted actually this that we're going to want to go get. Um, I was about to say though, I think our mission had been that we were going to, yeah, top up at the well. And can I get to the stronghold? I'd like to do that as well. Right, come and conquer this. Get all this. That's kind of what we want to do with Septiana now, I think. Can I get through to the stronghold? If I... Yeah, she can, right? So she can, she can kill the zombies. <laughs> yeah. So Uland isn't a, as big a priority as some of these other cool things sh she could be doing around here. Um, yeah, we got the hard things already, that's right. So, come and get the box. Hopefully it's actually got something in it. Um, Sticky was going to go just have a quick look. Ah, ha. Huh. That explains stuff. Wow, look where we are on the map here. We're here. And um, this is where Green was coming from. This is how they were getting to us. I had I'd pictured them galloping underground and coming up through this way. And um, yeah, it was a portal all along. Okay. So, that's really, really good, because it means once our army's bigger, we can just pop back through here and try to attack Styrium. Connect our empire together. It would be really nice to take Styrium and have a nice big supply chain all the way across here. Overground and underground. <clears throat> Wombling free. I know that 90% of you watching won't know what that means. Not familiar with the Wombles. Or you were uh, born in the 80s or, or later. So, uh, yeah, apologies to almost the entire demographic there for that reference. Now, uh, what's Sticky gonna do? I don't really want anyone to gallop out and tag me. And we need to be a bit careful about how far we think Green can get. So Green could get their army to about here on any given day. And that's a bit scary. Okay, so we're going to want to be able to quickly pull our army back down here uh, to this kind of central uh, node, this kind of region here in a pinch. So we are heading towards uh, an additional hero, I think. We have Nagash, but we're going to need more than that to get this done. Uh, now there's no one currently here. Our options are still Straker. Feels like ages ago we still were stuck with Straker. I don't really want him. Uh, and Zubin. Well, Zubin might be a good choice. Yes, I think I said this the other day. Because we have um, a stronghold that we can conquer. Uh, so he would be a stronghold hero, although his specialty isn't any cre of the creatures, so it doesn't really matter. There's not a big interaction there. Artillery doesn't matter if I don't have a ballista, so he's not a great hero to pick. Straker, Walking Dead, who cares? Right? Don't love either of them, so I might wait till next week to hire the next hero, I think. Nagash on day four, is this worth bothering? No, wait, there was something we had to do. Animate dead. That's right, it's all coming back to me. Okay. Sorry guys, you guys are watching this in like, real time, um, having just seen all of the battle happen with Septiana. Hmm. Let me just think about this. So what is she going to do? She, she's going to come this way. Okay. Do that. Um, come back here. Could hire one of them anyway and just jump in the boat and who cares if it's Straker. It's okay, I mean, he was never meant to be special. It's just that his army stinks. Literally. Like, I mean, his army smells as bad as it is possible to smell. Hmm. Coming. 
grabbing Animate Dead, getting underground and helping Septiana uh, work, his, w w work her way up through the ranks. Don't have to make a decision about uh, these investments just yet. Six skellies a week for a hundred thousand bucks. Who cares? Doesn't really matter. That's not needed for anything, is it? No. Could be cover of darkness time, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's an okay investment. Belching forth the black smoke of smoke of corruption. And these guys, I think, would look good. Dead. <laughs> oh man, this always just feels so evil. Nasty. Nasty business. Grim. Grim, you might say. Come here, my lizard babies. Daddy won't hurt you. Worth it? Why am I coming down here this week? What am I going to do? How am I going to help you? I'm going... The reason I'm coming down is that I'm, I'm going to be handy. You're going to give me the army and I'm going to come galloping, sprinting back down here. If a green hero arrives, that's what's going to happen. Right. I almost feel like getting a cheeky scout off here. It's just so useful, this intel. I do want to be able to get away, though. So there's a bit of perception there that they haven't taken. So I don't know, I think that's a week's worth of troops. Can she see? No, she can't. It's hoping for visions or whatever there. Um, although, hmm, what happens if I cast, no, not vision, yeah, no, view, yeah, visions, isn't it, visions, alright, look, whatever, I still haven't got these bad boys, I'd like to, like to get them, I think green is just turtling, anything else I want to send him off with, there's a first aid tent in his army, so we've both got first aid tents. What else do I want to give him? I'm not buying black knights and giving him like two black knights, then like what's the point of that? Like I don't have room in them. Two, two, two don't do enough. This seems alright. Blue, that's such a nice warehouse of gold. It's really, really good. Okay. Light blue, pink is messing around. Okay, so we're back at G. I think G's last mission was to just be a bit of a pain, come and maybe get back in the boat, have a look under here. Did I do this? Um, expert learning. I don't know anything though. What spell would I love to learn at level three? Will I bother? Okay. Looks like a pillar of darkness there. Oh wow, look at this! Untouched. Oh. Ooh, these are easy. Oh man. There's easy stuff here, unspoiled. No one's come here. How can Green not have done this already? Okay, I kind of want to get to that pillar, get back up, grab a small arm, come back and do, this, do these jobs. That's just ridiculous. I don't get why Green hasn't done that yet. Um, let's have a look here. So Septian is going to open the box. I don't get why the AI leaves boxes unopened unless they're planning to give it, let one of their other heroes come through and get it. Um, it just seems like a strange decision. Anyway, make it so. Okay, like what? Spells like what? Prot Earth? Destroy Undead's not something I'm planning on doing this game. Earthquake, maybe? Is that it? Misfortune, have Teleport, hello. And Forgetfulness, my new favourite spell from the uh, Conflux campaign. Two huge pickups right at the end, especially Teleport. Um, now, I'm an expert at Teleport. It costs three spell points. Has that been changed by Horn of the Abyss? Tell me. 
It was never three spell points. Teleports any friendly unit to any honor occupied spot on the battlefield. Undoes dendroids. Wow. This was amazing. Expert forgetfulness in my last. Uh, no, campaign before last uh, in the Conflux. Mirth won't be much use to me, sadly. And I imagine prayer doesn't work on my, my team either. So I really want that earth magic to start unlocking the, the, the big value tied up in there. Got that slot ready for it. Happy with that? Kind of would like to get some scouting off here. Could Nagash do it? I'm in a bit of a hurry. She went there, didn't she? No, she's going here next. Yeah. Nagash arrives. Uh, oh, hang on, we're all together. Oh, the team! We're all back together again. Reunited. Gotta get that chest back, and I want to flag this, so that's... Look at that, that's not too bad. So tomorrow she's standing roughly here. Um, okay, so I don't need to speak to her. Nagash can learn quite a lot of spells, actually, if he goes and talks to her. Can he learn teleport? Still just a basic scholar, that's... That would have been quite nice. I'm happy enough with this job. I could grab the army off you, actually, and we could do this. And then I can animate dead after the wolf raiders. But I gotta come all the way around to do that, man. That's too far. Yeah. Just tell me what's out there, man. Tell me what's through here. Nothing? Okay. Day five, let's talk investment. I think Black Knights are on their way. I can't see how we would not be doing that. Not quite ready for the Dragon Vault. Let's do this for now. Unearth Graves. Okay. So it's quietened down now that we've really given uh, Blue's taking all the fun stuff we wanted to do. Might just have a quick look at that blue hero. It might be worth going and trying to fight them. Okay. Yeah, solid army, right? Pretty solid. Can easily take this fight down. Should be able to take that comfortably enough, yeah. Eovasius. Uh, I think Septiana can beat him. Yeah, I should win that, right? I should win that. Alright, what can you do for me? Yeah. 2400 bucks. Okay, well, I'll pay it. Let's have a look at these guys. They're like, kind of like demons, right? Yeah. It's like just having eight demons. Oh, that's, that's, that's how I think of them. Uh, casting Mirth doesn't help me. But eight demons is better than zero. Don't know if it's great value for money. Get back. <laughs> uh, do I want to try to attack him with just this week's troops? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Because waiting around is... Hmm. What else could I do? So Nagash... So tomorrow, she goes back to base. Nagash comes back to about here. Septiana is going to stand about there. And I can actually give her a fresh army on that... On that supply chain. It's not a fresh army, but a, like I can give her an injection. She comes galloping through to here. She's here at the end of day one. 
He's going to get all the good stuff, but he won't have time to do all of it. And if he gets trapped in here, well, that probably connects through to there. Hmm. I think that seems okay. Okay, so let's do G first. We wanted to try to get to the pillar. Ah. Oh. Ooh, it's defended. Okay. Come back and get that when we come back and coming back. This is a really, really lush area that we want to try to tap into. Um, so yeah, so planning for day one, Stig's back in base overnight. This guy is standing here, not at the end of today, but at the end of tomorrow. Which means she has time to mess around a bit, but she's already been here, right? Except Jenna went to the, visit these boys. She's been all, she's, yeah, been all, done all this. She could do this, though. I don't think that's been hit yet. Okay, so he's got time to check this first. Let's just check. You've got to be back here. This time tomorrow. You've got to be, like, here. Let's get these good scouts done, man. Um, okay, so how do I use this red arrow? What am I trying to do? I'm trying to figure out where he can get to. I want you basically here. Yeah, he's gonna land about there, but it's a whole mercury mine. I'm gonna take it. There's more stuff up there, but anyway. Well, he could keep going and I could just hire someone. See what I mean? So he's going to get to there, which means Stig gets to, Stig comes galloping out of here, goes underground, or he gets to about there. He's going to have to go grab it, come running up the road. That's still all right. And that saves us an extra two and a half K to um, spend to, on, on day one. Is this on? Yes. Good, good girl. It's day six. Yeah, so she's got she's got a day of leisure up her sleeve. That's good. Alright. Nagash goes from here, he goes Badoom, Badoom, roughly? Did it get about here? Yep. She has to just kill the day. Okay. That's another K. It's about ten and a half grand. So we're just about on the plausibility mark of hitting this Hall of Darkness and. The problem is, do I gallop forth with a few black knights. I'm not even sure I do, right? I think I'll have another, I'll have six black knights. I'd rather have ten dread knights before I start buying them. But the extra vampire's coming as well. Yeah, I think that's okay. Ooh, he's coming to me. Great. That's very good. There goes an orange hero. We, we, won't get a, we won't get a good look at him. Okay, it looks like Uland and... Uh, Uland and this guy might come to blows. That could be very good uh, for us. <sighs> Except Jenna. Tell you what. Ooh. <laughs> Set the trap. Right, G. Um, get your butt back here. Um, should I get that tagged? Get in a boat and all that? Or should I try to just raise some soldiers and go and clear the stuff that's downstairs? That's good, easy stuff. Let's get it. Oh, man. Look at all this stuff. She needs to learn animate dead. She needs a whole 
She needs a makeover. Hmm. Day seven. What else is she gonna do other than that? Chuck that, chuck that. Grab that. I can see something floating in the water out there. I want it all. Could she summon a boat? Yeah, she can, right? No, she's too... Too tired? What do you mean you're too tired? I had to kill all those pirates. You made it so difficult for me. I'm sorry. It's the best I could do. <laughs> right, you're right. I'm sorry. That wasn't fair. Yeah. I mean, there's no reason. I, I don't have an army, so she can't do it. I don't have an army or spell points. You could hop in the water, and at least that way you're doing something. Someone else will have to come over and do this when I've got time. Right, she... No, Stig, sorry. Oh, phew. For a minute there, I thought... Oh, <laughs> it was close. It was close. Man, it was close. Okay, we're happy. How fast are these things? Speed 7, no, that's good. All right. Guys, get in position. Get back here. Where can you get to? There? Could be halfling time again. Stig's gets about here. He goes doof doof. Galloping up to... There? So by the time he's done that and that, it's probably going to be more like here. Except Jenna hits the oar again tomorrow. Sorry, I forgot where that was. Um, where can I get to? Oh, sorry. Hang on, I've got tons of moves. Except Jenna's really wasting a day here. But uh, I could have gotten to there, but because I'm going to go there first, can we make it? I'll stand here. So you stand next to this. In here, of course, yeah. So we're, mm, there's cover of darkness and stuff, but I just don't think Tan has any more nasties coming down this road. It'd be very, very sad if just before I reinforce Septiana, she gets attacked by something, but full spell points, army ready to go. Should be all right, right? Okay. Let's just check, actually, let's double check that we get our... Um, extra three vamps. There it is, look at that. It's even counting it. Beautiful. I just love it when it all clicks together. Right, Blue has changed his mind. Wow. Very strategic, very interesting. Okay, we have reinforcements. Ooh, decent reinforcements. Decent, but not crippling. Still green elves. Why? How can you not upgrade to grand elves yet? Like, I don't get how the AI doesn't do that. It just has vanilla dudes. Okay, so it's going to have a bit of reinforcement. I'm not too terrified of this. Ogres and dwarfs don't... You can't fit everything together there. you got the differing troop, troop types. Right, it's just elves and dendroids that are uh, in common. So you can't build a really nasty seven stack army with that collection. Year of the something that didn't matter, so that means all of our soldiers are here. Uh, and we've got 20 grand to spend. So let's do what we absolutely know we're doing, which is this. And this. Now. Who is the hero? Nimbus. Eagle Eye. Oh. Decent army. His army's good enough, though, to justify that, that investment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we'll buy Nimbus. Um, Eagle Eye, man. Now, these boys, if I was to buy them like this, are 7,200. I'm going to guess it's more like 9k for the... I think I should just have enough money. We're very low on crystal, um, again, so that's a real problem. 
Got it. It is 9k, look at that. Okay, so I'm thinking maybe I could leave the satyrs for Nimbus. And we could hire him tomorrow. They're, they're more likely to find their way to a happy home, right? Like, it's not like I'm going to go back down underground here and visit the visit this again, and then do something with them. What would I do that's of any use? Yeah. So I think we'll leave them here. We're out of coin anyway. Give me as many of these as you can afford with what's left. Two? Seriously? Oh my god. Can anyone get me any money? What are you doing? You're doing this? Oh, yeah. Is that what I want to do? Or do I just want to come back through and get all this? We'll hop in there. We'll hop in there. We'll see what's out there. Sticky. That's all the money I could get you. I don't want to do any bad trades. Happy enough. Let's just... Uh, I'd love it if these stables were on the way. Who builds the stables out in the middle of nowhere? Learn archery, no thank you. Oh, look at that! Smashed it! I hilariously have room for halflings, I think, in the army. <laughs> um... It's just too tempting. I'm just going to have to do that, I think. I've got time. She keeps this. Yeah. Yeah, we got time. Cool. No, I messed up a little bit. I could have gone a bit further with them. Boom, boom. My queen, I bring you fresh. Soldiers. Excellent. <laughs> uh, hapless. Doomed. Pathetic. Um, I don't want to share any of this wealth, do I? No luck. May I release thee. Go. Um, all right. What can she do? He's he's been spooked, hasn't he? I want to kill all of these people. Uh, this should be switched on again. Lovely. This would have been good. No time. There's just no time. Sometimes you just gotta move your keister. Can't do it all. Okay, what is Nagash going to do with the rest of his day? Um, come here, I don't know yet. No more money, so that's the end of that. Blue gets the gold. It's a bit annoying. Oh! Oh, green owns this area. Glad I got in the boat now. Okay, yes. These are the guys I want to kill. Who is that pink hero who just came down? Oh, nice. Everyone's starting to send forces in this region. That's great. Everyone's starting to coalesce here under the ground. I had hoped for a Water Matters uh, campaign, but... Anyway. What does this do? It gives you... Morale, I think. So I'm just not even going to worry about that. OK. 
Okay, the shipwreck, I'm nearly sure I need soldiers to... Will it tell me? Let's see what it does. What? Upon defeating the harpies? What harpies? You didn't tell me there were any. You spend several hours sifting through and I get bad morale? Well... Okay. Thankfully the skeletons are very chill. They're not too worried about it. What are we doing with our courier heroes? Let's just do Sepchana. Don't want to waste a move. Now, how far has he come? So let's say he gallops back. So if I come to here, I'm, I'm hoping to scare him out of doing that job. Yeah, this makes sense to me. And then this is mine too. That's already been taken. She's been there. She's been there. Yeah, this guy feels like he's a long way from home. He's just like, you know what? I'm going to bank my army. I've done a good scout. I've gotten some stuff done. Stole some things. I'm getting out. I'm getting out while the getting's good. Smash and grab. Uh, let's do the hiring now and see the hiring of Nimbus. See if he can get in this boat would be good. Well, we want to train him up first, don't we? Okay, let's hire him first. Nimbus. I am good at eagle eye. Nimbus. When he was a child, he had a small dog that eventually died of old age. He discovered by sacrificing a small bird or other creature he could resurrect the pet, a feat which he did repeated time each time with the dog, every time it died. Little did he realise that he was already exploring the beginnings of necromancy. Oh, young Nimbus. Oh, that, yeah, you should have seen him the other day. Oh, he was sacrificing animals on a little altar and bringing his dog back to life. Oh, he was just so adorable. Now look at him. He's this purple-skinned freak. Run in terror. Nimbus, Nimbus, Nimbus. What am I doing with you, my man? My dog? Uh, we could go for the temple now. But I don't have any money, really, for this kind of thing. Hang on, you've got to go to your training. So, let's do something like that. Go to here. Come back, go to here. Come back to here. Come back up to here, get in a boat. How good is that? Yeah, go do it, man. All right. Yeah, I've got another 4K coming tomorrow. I think I'm gonna do this and be happy. I'm definitely doing this um, upgrade. I'm okay with this. Yeah, see the upgrades are very cheap. We'll buy them tomorrow. He's actually gonna have a decent little army because he'll have the satyrs as well. Careful, just don't want to get tagged by them. I think it's okay to come here and wait. Yeah. Just have a quick look at the puzzle map again. Yeah, we're still pretty sure that's not in the region where they were digging. It's not possible, it's not possible, is it, that it's there? There's those mountains, is that right? Oh my god, they were right. They were they were right. So they got it? You're joking. Oh, <gasps> 
white thingy. Thingy thingy. It's here. It's in here. Oh man, that's huge. We think we know where it is. They were looking in the wrong place. It's in the center of the map, right? Bang in the middle. It's right here. Here. It's right here. It's on one of these two tiles. Right, so what do we do with that information? That's huge. I, mean, I never have enough information at this point in the vanilla game. But the way the map reveal works with um, Horn of the Abyss is you get to see more, you know, so we can triangulate between that, pick, that and that. It's definitely there. That's definitely it. It's just right there. Um, yeah. All right, let's see what happens up here. Blue runs home. Fine. Green. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that green hero. I meant to have a look at these guys, these two. Oh, okay, so, right. Hang on. Green, green, green. Sorry, I'd completely forgotten we'd seen that. Oh, they abandon Pink takes the castle. Oh, so much action. Pink takes the castle. These guys run for it. Okay, Aligar has the army. You have the big army. Oh. Teal. Teal, what are you doing? Now, green has returned with idiots. Okay. But they can dig. I can't do anything about that. I just can't do anything about it. I just don't have the forces in the area, sadly. Right, come see what you can find. I don't think these are going to help me. Oh, there's a hero out here. <sighs> Try and drag him off course at least. Well, they give me luck. Okay. Well, she's going to need it if he tracks her down. So green have assets out on the water. That's interesting. Yeah. Our old arch nemesis right from the beginning of the game. I might have known. All right, which of you would like to die first? Is it you? Uh, or actually, was, is it in here? Can I just go and take this? Day three? Yeah, we want to just kill Uland, right? And then we can take the rest of these things at our leisure. I'm coming in to take over this territory now, Uland. Alright. First fight of the night, I think. It's all been very strategic and logistical, hasn't it? Up until now. Just rearranging my mouse pad here. I want to get psyched, I want to get pumped. I want to remember everything she can do. Her latest idea? Expert teleport. I can think of a couple of units I'd like to do that with. Three spell points for teleport. I still can't believe that. I don't remember it being that cheap. Uland. Oh wow! Look, big complicated fight. I don't, uh, I don't auto resolve. So this is coming through. I'm just going to crank my music so I can have a nice listen to all the uh, action. Uland has eleven spell points, and his elves act first. Okay. I now know rather a lot of spells. Forgetfulness is an option. <laughs> no, I have the range advantage. I'm just going to take a hit from the elves and then go from there, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, what do you want to do? 
Magic arrow my halflings, okay. Alright. So it's easily this, right? Yeah. Oh no, bad morale. How can you have bad morale? You got, is this, does this count as a third troop type? Ooh. You've got negative morale? What have I got? I've just got neutral. Oh yeah, of course I have. Stand here, old son. Um, yeah, just do your job. Oh, you guys are so dead. You shouldn't have done that. <laughs> dear, oh dear, oh dear. Poor misguided fool. I haven't needed any uh, spells. Kills 15 to 24, so if I bloodlusted these, maybe. Don't, don't really need to do anything, right? I could just save my spell points. Let's do this. Key thing is not letting him run off uh, before I'm, you know, able to animate dead, like, whatever. Yeah, let's just stay here and do it. Oh. Ow. Okay, you got my attention. He can't be magic arrowed, can he? And then he runs off. That would be annoying. That would be very annoying. Don't do that to me. Oh, it's slow. Okay. Phew. Still got 76 here. Pretty nice. Now watch this, people. G. G, I wonder if these guys are going to survive. <laughs> Can't do that in the vanilla game. Cannot do that in the vanilla game. Ooh. Uland, are you going to commit suicide, pal? Uland? Uland, you don't have time. I can kill Uland. What if I just kill... I have three units acting before... He acts, and two spells. Can't I just kill you? You've only got 300 HP of dudes there. That should be enough. You've got 300 HP of dudes here. You've got about the same there. Try and do it cheaply. I don't think you're going to be able to get away from me now. Oh, the ballista. He must have had. He must have ballistics, or um, oh, I nearly hit the cancel button. Yes, apply battle result. He must have artillery. I lost thirteen halflings and four spell points. Enslaved fifteen of his corpses. Okay. And which one would we like to do first? While we're here, come down and get the box, get the crystal, or grab the boots. Mm. Okay, I think this is all connected, right? And I like these shiny boots. Now with that said, I don't know if I'll have the moves left. I will. So on that basis, I'm going to do this fight too. So you guys get a bonus fight for the evening. Um, a horde of sorceresses now. They cast weakness after they attack. I think these quite things are quite nasty. So I'll be animating my liches back to life. Yeah, this is going to hurt, but teleport might be, might be important here. Let's have a look. 
Board of Sorceries as well. Yeah, they hurt like hell. Okay. Apply battle result. No. Oof. Look at them. Look at these ladies. Okay, so shoots and then casts after shot at an advanced level. And I believe what she casts here is weakness. So they're kind of like liches, is how I like to think of them. Health 35, attack 12, defense 9. Is that a fair comparison? Health 30, attack 13, defense 10. Yeah, ish, right? Speed 6, these guys are speed 7. They just... They do weakness as well. This is the upgraded one, this is the, ju this is the junior lich. So that's how I like to think of them. They're both level 5. Um, yeah, the teleport seems amazing here, right? Let me just check how this works. If I do it on the Dread Knight's turn... It's still their turn. Yeah, it's nice. Kills 4 to 8. Go ahead. Killed six. She, yeah, look at that. What? Why'd you attack him? Dreads are taking damn. Ooh. Some are skellies. What is it with you? Oh, surely I can't target a tile that one of my boys is on. I can. Does that hurt my guy as well? How's that gonna work then? Let's check. So I'm doing the ground thing, right, where I can hit any hex I want. And I'm going to I'm going to target my own guy. It shouldn't hurt him. It did. Sorry, it did. Apologies, mate. Okay. Worry not. We have some animate deads, but we are going to be wanting to use them on uh, multiple units. I don't think we'll need them on the vamps though, right? Because they're going to do this, yeah. So, do I want to do it yet? How many HP does it restore? Not enough have died yet to get the best out of it. It's like 480 something. 480, I need, yeah, I need four to have died. The fight only ends when I say it ends kind of thing. So I might just save the spell points, wait for them to do their thing, and then animate. Oh, deadly. Yeah, do your thing. Hopefully hit the Dread Knights for me, so I've got a nice clean stack to... Great. Yeah, that's good, that's good. That's ideal. Nice. Um, no, can, I, can I do that? I don't. That's not going to hurt my guy if I do that, though. I'm going to test this before I resurrect. Yeah, 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 yeah. So the actual central hex is always taking damage from the death cloud, regardless of whether you're undead or not. Um, so that's important. All right, dreadies, come back to me. Ooh, yeah, what a spell, what a spell. Well, maybe I could wait, no, I might wait. The vamps do their thing, man. So they both have a turn. Is there any world in which they both die in retaliation? Don't think so, because she's going to have to shoot once I leave her alone, and she'll shoot these. Right, she can't walk from there. The AI is not allowed to do the move that we're allowed to do. Ooh, so she did die in retaliation. Yeah, cool. I don't remember how many we had to start with. Um, I think we have our whole army back. Just about. Yeah, none. And, yay! 
Yay! Yes! There it is, people. Oh, I really want Advanced Scholar as well. But, no, no, no. Basic Earth magic is in the house. We are rocking and rolling, and I get V. Ta da! You meet a wanderer in rugs on a shallow path. He offers you to exchange your cape for his old boots. You agree without much enthusiasm. As he disappears over the horizon, you realize the advantage of the transaction. It's the Wayfarer's boots. My, my. Oh, decent. Very nice. So that's expert pathfinding. Expert pathfinding. I think these are new in uh, Horn of the Abyss. Not part of the vanilla game. Cool. Cool feature. Cool idea. Really, really nice. I get to do this as well. And then I'll come back down to this. And uh, we'll grab the stronghold at some point. Does Pink know that I'm here? Maybe, maybe they will fill it up tomorrow with troops. Um, this is good stuff, though. This hasn't been visited by anybody either. We can get that. Just be careful with the vampires. Right. Nimbus. Oh, I just realised something. I'm Mr. Nimbus. <laughs> uh, another reference for anyone who's interested. Nimbus. The best thing you can do, Mr. Nimbus, is... You don't know Animate Dead. Gonna go with power. Power's worked for me. It has, it's worked for me. Come back, jump in here. What time to do that first? It could be crystal. Is anyone else coming back this way? I'm doing this. And I'm gonna grab these idiots. Who are these guys? Oh, are they movement four? Everything's movement four though, right? So who cares? Moving four? Speed three, oh my god. Speed three. Health one. I regret that. Sure, that's handy. Tempted, I could run over here and grab these. I'm insisting on Nimbus being the explorer. Like, Stig has air magic, wisdom, she can learn, animate dead. Uh, surely Stig's the... She gets to be promoted, right? She gets to jump in the boat here. Go be good for all of us. Construction here is going to come to a halt, I think, for a while. All right. Not a bad turn. Pathetic. What? They have fly? Did you guys see that? This guy here, he flew over the rocks. Erdemon, how did you fly? How did he fly over there? He must have a scroll of fly or something? That character doesn't have uh, wisdom. No, it doesn't come with it, right? He's a planeswalker. Oh, look at the effect of the stables. It's like 50% additional movement. I didn't know. 
Oh, look how far further Nimbus can move than Lizzie. Stig. I mean, amazing. Right, hang on, let's do the main event first. I can do this fight right because um, I can reanimate. I have the spell points. I got, there's a mage guild in here. I can spend the night after I've taken that town. So I think it's okay. I don't love it. Oh, let's see if I can match that. So there's 75 of them. Oh, okay, it's not too bad. Right? It's not too bad. Oh, good. All right. Oh, I never absorbed them. That was stupid of me. Is it worth animating? Oh, they probably are enough to anim worth animating now. Um. think worth it. 21 skellies for 15 spell points. 12 spell points. I don't know. Maybe it's worth it. But they were pussycats in the end, weren't they? Mm. Skeletons aren't really becoming a thing. No, especially when you don't manage them properly. Six Cyclopses, what am I going to do with them? Mirth? I guess I can mirth them. Uh, kill the halflings. It's minus one morale they're at. Not useless. Can attack city walls. I'm not going to have to. Why wouldn't Pink put something there? I'm going to put something there. I want to do this job, but this is too important, right? I can flag this and leave some annoying troops behind the walls. And then coming back down and finish the jobs. That happened to me in my last campaign too. Like the enemy just leaving the gates open. Hall of Valhalla. Well, Deception is certainly the first uh, necromancer they've seen in a while, in a long time in the Hall of Valhalla. But nonetheless, now she knows how to do stuff. What do we have here? A city hall is decent. It's just a fort. Big mage guild. Nothing I want, though. Dispel? She didn't know, I don't think. Okay. You can trade creatures for resources in the freelancers guild. It's a thousand bucks, so you could maybe sell the Cyclops. Although the Cyclops go with this. Quite neatly. Yeah, interesting. I'm just trying to decide what I want to do here. Um, might pause there and come back uh, tomorrow for the next mini installment but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed those couple of combats good old vampires, liches and animate dead, there's just nothing like it nothing like it in the world back the next day here and I have to decide what we're going to do now with Septiana I don't really want her sitting here overnight just in case there's a really big comeuppance coming down <laughs> this way from pink I think I like the idea of leaving these guys here since they are natives of this uh, town anyway, it's a little bit of a, a little bit of a theme. It could be worth it to give them a bit more beef. Put the citadel in. Don't hate that idea. Might instantly regret that, but it's only two and a half k. Get the arrow tower. Just that's a real nuisance for someone to try to attack that now. Um. The two towers probably have been visited, certainly the black one, but I think it's worth having a look. I'd like to see how much a cannon costs. Um, that would be interesting to me. In any case, there's very little downside 
with having Sephi on the stand here with what she has left. We have Nimbus as well. We got about him. It occurred to me actually, if you ignore the purpleness, he actually looks a bit like Mr. Nimbus from the TV show. Hmm. What am I doing with you, Mr. Nimbus? You can go here. save that, it might come in handy. I'm just going to give you a really basic army. You can start exploring. Stick and buy a new boat, come in here. You can come maybe down this way. I think I'm okay with this. Should have stopped to the windmill, that was a mistake. Okay. I think G, you know, green has really reasserted itself. It's going to be very hard for us to attack green profitably. I'm much more interested in trying to find that second necropolis now. Just reveal a bit of the map, see what's out here. Right, pop in here. What did he take? He took zombies. I've got these for you. Could pop down and quickly grab them. I might just do that. I'm sailing away, you take that. I know these things, right? It's a good rendezvous. Okay, take four, I don't want to wait. Just want to get moving, I think. She doesn't do necromancy, this girl, that's the only problem. But she does do animate dead. Which will be in her spell book now. Yep. Okay. Staying the night doesn't help, does it? He's already at full. Happy with that? The only question, residual question, is should we hire a hero here and go running up there with them? What if we hire her, Tyrus or something, comes up here, comes around here. This might not all be connected, and I think Pink went this way. to do that, right? There's Stronghold. Cavaliers with tactics and leadership or logistics, artillery, and yeah, yeah. Let's get her. Need some money. Uh, Mercury up my sleeve. How much do I need? A bit more. Sorry, wrong building. This one. Pyre. She immediately learns from the Hall of Valhalla. Very nice. Now then, 3211, pretty decent. No one knows her real name, but it is rumoured that she was once a member of the Humanists, a foul cult bent on eradicating any non-human inhabitants of Arathia. Only she knows what motivates her to serve the devils of Eofol. Well, being a human humanist, um and wanting to eradicate all other races, um, 
maybe uh, maybe you're in the right place. Maybe you've um, you know you've gone and found a, a place that you belong. Um, certainly sounds evil, doesn't it? Anyway, she's good with a ballista, so who knows why she wants to serve me and work with all of these grotesque green creatures. But um, I guess the coin is there, right? Twenty-five hundred gold. So let's see how she uh, performs. Uh, is it worth it to drop the imps? Probably. Yeah. Can you tell me what's up here? May as well have a look in here too. I haven't got any money. Royal griffins are here. Okay. Yeah, it is kind of connected together. Oh, that's a behemoth crag. Hello. Heck yeah. How does that work? Do I have to beat behemoths to hire them? There's also a horde of gnolls here guarding something. So there's some green pasture up here. We could send Sienna up this way. Sienna. I keep saying Sienna. Septiana. Maybe. We'll see if Pyre gets killed here. What is the point of that? So he, he just has flying, really? Angel wing boots, maybe? That artifact, like, it just seems so strange that he's flying around. Okay, there's Anan. We avoided his attention. That's great. Out on the water. What could be fun? Finer. Behold his sanctuary not visited. Guessing there's beholders there? There's flotsam there, I'll take that. Tavern. Okay, this is a cool feature, out out on the water. Wouldn't mind popping in there. You might get a free it might be the Dens Guild, Thieves Den. Thieves Guild. Den of Thieves effect, maybe? Uh, where you get full information. Nimbus. What's out there, man? Oh, yeah. Oh, five stone. That's not very good. What do these guys do? Sirens. I can't remember. Doesn't look like I can actually walk on them, so... Huh. That's interesting that the game's generated that. It's un ungettable. Never seen that before. Pyre is here the next day. Septiana, let's make some easier decisions first. We said she was getting in the water. I think I stand by that. What are you going to do with your empire? I have full visibility at least. Let's do what we said. She could try to summon a boat, actually, given that... How does this work? If I try to summon a boat and I'm not standing on the coast. I'll oh, just stand on the coast anyway. I think I'm willing to give this a try a couple of times. There are no boats out there. Okay, yeah, if you're not a water mage, an expert water mage, you can't create boats from nothing. You need to steal one, an empty one. So we'll just build one. Jump in. Let me just check. Are we happy with this? You've got the, yeah, chest of thingy. Jump in. It's always such a turn guzzler, you know, going from boat to non-boat and back again. Nagash. That's been done this week. Is it safe for him to come do this? Not really. I don't have much for him to do. That didn't get done. It's not a very good payoff. I just don't need the stables. Really should be upgrading these five crappy skeletons in the necro. That's probably I should have ducked my head in the door and done that. Um, how's this going to go down? What do we want to do? I think, Septiana, can you tell me firstly what's happening here? I 
I lost my halflings. It's now an empty and holds nothing of interest. I don't have time to come and do all this. I need to ca like kind of keep moving. Pyre, tell me the story. What is up here? I'm very interested in that. Ah, uh, there's a portal. That's where Pink came from. I just want to know, can I buy these? Or do I have to fight them? I can, but there's none here. All right. So I feel like maybe Sefjan is supposed to stick her head through here. I can get to about here. She could come to here and defend Pyre, and then she could go do this. It means we aren't getting this Pandora's box and this crystal, which is really important. Yeah, she's my emissary. Tell me what I'm dealing with, and I'll defend you. Everything's connected, you see? Okay, so there's a central sort of staging area where things join up together. Okay, so I have to kind of come this way now because otherwise... Um, Yeah, I'm just okay to stand on the portal. Right? Okay, that's nice. There's a pillar of something there. Okay, we're out in there over here now. Okay, right. So it's complicated. While she's standing there, um, no one can surprise the stronghold. Don't think it justifies hiring anybody or building anything, does it? It's still not clear that we've got this town, really, so I don't want to invest mega bucks in it. I don't want to build anything there today. Okay. That's the cove fellow we saw earlier. Green. Not really doing anything. Okay, he's doing something. I, think th I imagine this will be a fight that we can't do, the Pillar of Eyes, but I kind of want to see what the tavern does. No, okay, I was hoping to get more data. It's worth a little pit stop though, let's just have a look. So orange, wow, is that Isra? Isra. Very, very strong. That's what I'm up against with the cover of darkness, is it? Yikes. Okay, there's a couple of those who are falling behind. You can see Teal is in big trouble. Yeah. Blue is really bad. Blue and red are pretty bad. Um, orange is the best. Um, number of towns. We're in the top half, so having two towns is... We've got the most heroes, six heroes. We're the poorest. Okay. Um, well, we're sixth, sixth out of eight. All right. Who's this kid chap? Zilare. Speciality is forgetfulness, that's interesting. Right, I don't really want to hire any of you. Well, what am I going to try to get done? I'm all the way out over here, I kind of need to get back to land. Come this way. Right, I'll stop in there and just check what that is. I imagine it's just a fight I can't do. I meanwhile have an army. Sailing forth. Okay. Great. Cool. Observation tower in the middle of the water. Nice one. Nice. 
we needed that. Very, very nice. Come on back and do that job that I said to do before. We don't want these if we don't have to have them. And I think I like the idea of Nagash waiting for a horse at the beginning of the week. No, but then he can't do the... Hmm. What's more important to me? No, I can go get the horse on day one. I'd rather have the three vampires, right? Yeah. Forgot, forgot about that. Okay, now, explorers. Tell me, tell me, tell me. If I come up here, will I die to Evacuous? Yes. If he wants to uh, come see me. But if he wants to come see me, he's going to have to deal with my friend. Let's just get some of this revealed. Could have given the ballista to Septiana. Okay. Come back down. There's stuff for her to do here. Can she get in there? No, she can't get in there. Maybe under here she can. Pit floors look like... Pit fiends look like they'll die. That's an orc tower, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so the best stuff's been done. That'll be vague. That'll be gone. Okay, Nimbus, what are you up to? Oh, a shipwreck survivor. Ooh, pull a shipwreck survivor from certain death in an unforgiving ocean. Grateful, he rewards you for your act of kindness by giving you the soaking wet amulet of the Undertaker. Uh, which, as most of us probably are aware, increases our necromancy. But in the old days it would have been by 5%, and in the new days, under Horn of the Abyss, it's 2.5%. Okay, which we have to accept. Oh, which way do I go? I'll go for this. I want to know what that is. Shipwreck. Okay, both finding interesting things out there. That's good. Septiana. Hmm. I'd like her to run up under here now and maybe clear that as well. Thing you can get get this this girl can get ready to buy behemoths. Seems useful. Um. But on the other hand, I really do want to clear that. Get this? Yeah, I want this. I want this more than I want anything else. Another gaslit tower. Producing enough light to penetrate. Boom! There it is! Hey, there it is! The Necro! Ah, oh, sweet. There's nothing like scouting. None of these armies work together. You've got a big mishmash of dudes that don't work together. I want that town. I want that town. I want that mine. I want that mine. I want everything that's here. This all belongs to me now. Ooh! I want to go there. Warehouse of Crystal. There you're talking. All this belongs to me now. This is my... this is me. I feel like what we could do is lay siege to Merist. We could park Septiana here, prepare for Nagash to reinforce her. By running up this way. What a pain in the backside for them. I like the idea of besie I like the idea of the besiege tactic. I think that's right. Even though there's stuff that she could be doing. Eh. I'm a bit torn, I'm not sure if this is right. No whammies, no whammies. Oh no 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 no. What? What? Right, who are you? Ainan? <laughs> uh, that's bad. Oh man, that's not good. So, Ainan... Green has already been up through all this region here. 
So my sense is Aenon is here for a fight. With Firebirds and Phoenixes. He wants to come up here and take my stuff. And now I'm feeling... Well, actually, so she could actually come through here, right? So could Septiana come galloping down here to try to save the day? Is that better than going for it? I'm going to need to think about this. I'm going to need to dwell, I think. Having thought about it, okay, I've thought about it. I think that an Arian, Aenon, I think he's not here for a holiday. Green has already been up this way, so I think he's turning left. He's going to come and challenge us. So I think it's better to get Septiana down here. If he doesn't, then we can reconsolidate with fresh troops and then come back and challenge Marist up here for the Necro. I just feel like it's easier for me to reinforce than it is for her to get fresh fortress troops. Probably. Um, and I don't know what the AI will do when I attack if it occurred to me that fighting that really good elite fortress troop this you know several chaos hydras behind the walls was, is going to be possibly a problem because I'm going to be I'm not going to have enough turns to do all the teleporting and raising dead you're asking an awful lot of six dread knights and 36 vampires really in that scenario so I feel like it's probably Better to take the less glamorous route and just get down here. If an Aryan wants to fight this army, oh! If an Aryan wants to fight this army, he can. And I'm happy with that. You know, like like that's going to be a, again a nasty fight. But I should be all right. Um. So orb of driving rain gives me plus fifty percent to my water damage, but I don't have any water damage except for. Yeah, so she doesn't know Ice Bolt. So that would be a good thing to have. It makes Frost Ring worse. So it makes Frost Ring a bit meaner. It'll do 200 and something damage instead. Uh, yeah. Um, hmm. Normally I would say yes. And this time's no different. Yeah, see, that's the problem. That's the kind of guy. They're the kind, these are the kind of dudes I'm going to lose. Because I can't drain their essence. I can animate my own dudes back though. Um, yeah, there's nothing else I want to do. Casting magic arrows at them is pretty pointless. Um, oh look, just do something guys, it doesn't matter. Kill as many as possible. So these guys are... Oh, that's tons. That's more than I thought. Um, yeah, so these guys are a new addition. Kind of the next thing on from an iron golem, but not as good as a diamond or gold golem. It's like an in-betweeny kind of golem. Golem golem. Curse a golem? I suppose you can. I think these guys are running, and then the Dread Knights are just going to stand up here and survive. Survive this attack? Yeah. Okay. So, a little bit of. Um, I love the way they crumbled there. So, that animation, the whole thing of the Steel Golems just fits so perfectly. It looks like it's always been part of the game. You'd never know it wasn't part of the original game. Like, all right, gimme, gimme, gimme. You come across a Chondra who begs to accompany you and your army a while for safety. You agree, and he offers his payment a strange orb of the elements. The orb of driving rain. So water, so that now does 180 damage for a magic arrow, which is nearly as good as a lightning bolt and saves me six spell points. So that's something. Um, we just need, all right, Anarian. Yeah, see, I didn't get very far down there. I'm hoping we won't get punished for that. 
Hoping we won't get punished, we'll see. Right, what do these do? Beholder Sanctuary. Guarded by a throng of beholders. I think I might leave you guys to it. <laughs> uh, maybe I should have checked up there. Oh, what's this? Second level spell. Protection from air. Well, okay. Keep going, G. Who else have I got on the water? Nimbus. What's in the barrel, man? Six Merc, not bad. I uh, might just remind myself what these are. Pack of Whites, yeah. I'm tempted to try that, actually. Uh, let me just check, what does he know? It'd have to be, what spells does he know? Yeah, so De Death Ripple won't work. Just, uh, I'd be half tempted, but... Like, if it's 19, that's going to be a problem, right? I'm not going to be able to kill enough. There's a thing to be said about giving your really junior heroes a little bit of army, a little bit more than just a totally notional... Oh. Army. Pyre. Can you be my behemoth lady? What's happening on the other side of the portal? Where is that? It's up here. It's here, isn't it? Okay, so actually, Pyre, can you stick your head through? Because we do need to try to keep... Yeah, keep an eye out for what's going on. That's perfect. That's great. Stand there for tomorrow. Nagash, go and wait here. We're, get, we're banking on him not being able to take, <laughs> take my town. Uh, so he's got the chest. Stig, you're out on the water. Let's look at this. Oh, very good. Go get this first, I suppose. Five ore. Vitamina, with a pretty bad army, checking things out. Look at all the snowy tree. That's a new, a new feature, I think. Cause trees co didn't get covered in snow in the old... This is a new thing right here, the frozen overground entry. I don't want to challenge Vitamina, do I? No. What's this? Go here. Weakness, not bad. Uh, shipwreck, I can do that. If it's white, like uh, what uh, Nimbus had. Come here first, maybe? Or I could do this to hook around. Um, what do these guys give you? Luck? Yeah, let's have some luck. Alright, okay. In terms of investment for tomorrow... I don't know. I'm definitely not doing ghost dragons or bone dragons. What could I do here? Cyclops needs an ogre fort. Ogre forts cost 20. It's a bit expensive. Mess hall, maybe? Eight extra gobbers a week to go with the 20. So it's still just a citadel. I don't think we want to invest in this town just yet. It feels like it is ours, but could be taken off us again pretty quickly, right? Still not in control of that portal or that overground, really. So I think we'll just bank. Let's just see what um, an Arian wants to do. Aenon, Enane, Aenane. How are we supposed to pronounce any of the names in this game? I don't know. <laughs> like even Pyre. How do you pronounce Pyre? That's probably right. Nimbus is Nimbus. That's easy. Nagash, Septiana, Stig. I guess they're not that hard. Yeah, G, Zai. Am I just really bad at pronunciation in general? Okay, Green, you are wasting your lives. What are you doing? Really, that's your objective? To just get that sulfur? Oh man, it's all happening. Orange, pink, everywhere. I might need to replay the turn and see all that again. The last thing we saw was this. Okay, so Fafna. We'd love to kill Fafna. We would love to kill him. But I'm out of position to do that? Anane is out of position to do anything. Uh, what should I do? Oh man, okay, let's do the water stuff first. Um, Crystal, fantastic job, Nimbus. Love your work, my man. 
Yeah, do this. Get these are great. This is a brilliant addition to the game. Um, distant lands while at sea. That's really good. It was a waste of his moves, but now I can just plot a traveling salesman thing around to just get all this, which is really good. It's good that there's all these things out here to fight as well, which wasn't the case in the old days in the vanilla game. Um, yeah, so you're doing this job. Seems okay. Bit of luck. I think that's morale. I might not bother with that. G. Okay, so everyone remember next time we're coming out, we want to bring soldiers that are good against beholders, because there seems to be an awful lot of those beholders' sanctuaries. Tell me about this place. Like, what is here? What is that? I'm not looking forward to seeing what that thing is. <laughs> right, it's day one. Uh, what are we going to do? See what Fafner wants to do. He can't do it in one day. And then she could make another decision. Right. So let's just do that. You get one behemoth for your trouble. Go here, because you haven't done that. Okay, take the artillery. Um... Or go to the windmill that appears to be there. So let's say Fafner changes his mind. Yeah, let's go here. Try to reveal a bit more. Yeah. I think that's better. Right. So I'm not making purchases in the stronghold today. I'm definitely making the purchases I'm supposed to be making here. Now Septiana's skeleton bank is at 88. So... She's got two free slots, so I could just, you know, go for Skeleton Warriors this time here. And uh, maybe Halflings on the way through. Still don't have time to do this. They're still unupgraded, but... I can get away with that, I think. Just buying all these, right? Just gimme. Just gimme, 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 gimme. Alright. And actually, give me this, because I'll use it to run around with. Well, I'll probably keep these guys, won't I? Yeah. Um, no time for pleasantry, so I'm going to have half my moves left here. Kind of want to stand here. Is there any case for going for for this? I'll stand here then. Then tomorrow, I come galloping down. I'll have so many moves, it's not funny. I can easily get to here. Yeah, it depends. I think that's a good move. The question is, is Septiana going to come and try to do this? If I stand here, he might see me before he starts moving, and that would be a problem. So I want to stand about here, which means I've got time to go here. Get these little idiots. There may be, there may be an opportunity to turn our skellies into good skellies. There might be. So I can cover, I can cover that tomorrow, right? No, I can't. I'll be there tomorrow. So the question is, should I stand there, and then I will be able to stand... I'd be able to stand on this. So let's say he gallops off that way or something. Why would I want to do that? The answer is so that I can take the conflux if he's stupid enough to run this way to get boars or something, and then go to the witch's hut or some idiotic move. So does he have time to go to do that today? And then tomorrow, I could take your skeletons and take them back to get upgraded. I think yes. I think yes. I bought everything here. Yep. Yeah. We can upgrade the liches too. I think this works. See, the thing is, once you visit the stables, it gives you extra moves on top of the fact that it sets you up for the, day, for the next day. How important is it to cover that portal tomorrow? 
So if he's in here, I'm fighting him. If he's in here, I don't need to. So I'm just going to play it safe and stand here. I don't really want to fight him today. I don't want him to come around here and fight me now. I don't think that's going to happen, though. Alright, so meanwhile, up over here, we don't have to defend this against Fafner if we don't want to. And we don't have to decide yet. Pyre can come running back here, grab the Cyclop, and just come running down here. Might even try and do one of these, grab this. She can just evacuate. And let him have it. Not ideal. Yeah, alright, let's see what they do. And they're ain't around. Can I can I get you? Can I get you to blunder? No. Nah. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Can't get him. Wow. Oh, that's the worst possible outcome. Man, oh man. So I just get the worst of everything there, like everything, the worst possible moves. Who are you, Vitamina? You're there? How do I know what's in this area? I can't remember. Oh, that must be from the um, lookout. Okay, I don't need to worry about you there, right? I don't need to worry about who that is. That's terrible. That is a terrible outcome. And now he's there? Has he seen? He must have scouted this area. That's the only explanation for that. Alright, here's the question. Can I take the conflux? That plus that. I think the answer is no. <laughs> it's just too hard. I don't have enough. I'm not going to have enough. Ten Dreadknights can't do all this on their own with Teleport. Vampire Lords get no regen. It's just too hard. So we've chased him away. whoop de doo Right. Let's stay in touch and just go back to plan A. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I can only assume they have the scouting. They know what they're doing. Is that worth going out of my way or should I just keep going this way? Might just keep going this way. Free money. Um, let's try to get it all. Nimbus, good work. Good work so far, Nimbus. Stiggies. Stiggles. 1500 bucks. Sometimes in the old game it used to have five grand in it. Yeah, what's here? I can kill them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is not a problem. Oh, that's annoying. Um, okay, so Death Ripple won't work. This does 74 points of damage. Which is enough to kill a stack. These boys are going to kill one. I can definitely afford some spells here. It's not a problem. Out on the open sea. Stig breathing in the... Uh, Salty air. With their undead shambling masses of walking death. Helps to be lucky in life and in death, as we can clearly see. These satyrs are like, this is the worst party in the history of satyrdom. Do I want to do that? Do I need to? Can we get away with it because of the wounds closing and all that? Um, yeah, these guys are like demons basically, right? Three grand, three k, decent. Quite the little kitty from the uh, folk out on the water. Very happy with that. Now, Pyre. Oh dear, oh dear, Pyre. Come back to Pyre. We've got a problem. <laughs> Do Fountain of Youth. What happens when 
an ancient crone of pure death visits the fountain of youth. Shall we all find out together? Okay. <laughs> you drink from the waters and feel young again? Really? As if it was possible for Ji to feel young again somehow, even the fountain is like, yeah, yeah, that's cool. Sensing your renewed vigor, your army's morale improves, allow you to cover additional ground as you head to the next battle. Uh, okay. Right, there's more evil eyes. Just checking everything out here. Okay. Wow, that's amazing. Fountain of Youth. Uh, let me come back to Pai, she's the hardest problem. I don't think we can do this fight. Anarian has scouted this region, he can see what we're doing. He knows what, He knows we know what he's doing. It's just not a thing. It's not going to work. So what we need is classic old supply chain dynamics. We need Nagash ready to come back quick and quickly bring the army back to threaten an area and if he tries any funny business we've got, we've got him boxed in here he's got nothing to do with his life he went out on the water for a while you know and then he's like oh they might try and come back maybe they've gone away now and then he's seen Septiana run for it I just don't think we've got much choice other than to do that so I want these soldiers today I'd love to do I'd love to set things up with our next hero so that I can upgrade the skeletons and the liches. Okay. Yeah, we have to just... I think we're going to do that consolidation move. So, who do we have? I'm not necessarily looking for an undead hero. Okay. Um, Ranlu. Ranlu is, I believe, a new... Well, I know, is a new hero from uh, Horn of the Abyss. He replaces someone who the developers was were unhappy with, or the multiplayer community weren't happy with. Might have been the vampire guy, the skeleton guy probably, the, or the necromancy, maybe there's a necromancy hero. Anyway, who, there's there's one undead hero who got booted out and replaced by this, and there's a couple of these around the place. There's a castle hero, so Muluk and others that got killed off and replaced by others. Um, now he has... He's got this ballista thing going as well, with, like, Pyre has. And then there's Aiden, the heretic. He's quite intelligent, but his army's no good to me. He has wisdom, so at least he could learn animate dead. Randlu's ballista and his army, though, I think is going to clinch it for me. All right. One, two, three, four. He's our fifth undead hero, so probably don't want any more than that, right? Ranlu, tell me about yourself. Following a dream in his childhood, Ranlu became an aide at Mesley's Armory. Ancient Master's gift was no law, rather a bite to the neck and a pit in the Talon Woods. Undeath wasn't fun, but Ranlu's hands got as crafty as ever. Soon he was wearing Mesley's Master Blacksmith Diadem. After running him through with a missile from a self-designed ballista, ooh. Man. Right. Well, our friend Ranlu here is, uh... Yeah. Certainly had a history of his own, hasn't he? Crikey. Okay, I'm not sure I can really trust you, Ranlu. Like Mesley, what happened? What what did Mesley do that made you so made you want to impale him on your ballista? Because I don't have a very fun life for you here, man. I'm just using you run up and down like an idiot. It occurred to me I should have built the Tomb of Souls yesterday or on day seven and just started to save up and maybe in the late game we'd have a stack of like fifty. Especially if we're getting a second Necropolis, that was a mistake. I should have gone. I should have had them working by now. Um, yeah, so I think it's the upgraded mausoleum we're building today. Let's just do this quickly. Chuck them there for now. And if I run to here, or let's say here, yeah, that's a third of my moves. That's perfect. So if I come to... There. So 
I may need Septiana to come up and help a little bit. Use some of her moves. Okay with that, if it helps me get away faster. I'm tempted to, actually, I'm tempted to just do this with her. Let's just get back, anyway. Just wish it wasn't so far out of the way. I hope I've got this the right way around. Septiana teaches a bunch of stuff, but only the basic level stuff. Give me everything. No, don't do that. Here we go, do that. Give me these and give me those. I'm going to go and upgrade them. Wait there, I'll be right back. That's all I can do for you. I think, I think, I think that works. That kind of works, doesn't it? swap a -roo. Actually, I'll take the blister if you don't mind. I do mind, that's my ballista, give it back, that's not fair. That can be your little army. Family goes back. Have I worked this out right? No. I haven't worked it out right. Anyway. Upgrade the mausoleum. Cool little skull goes on top. It's so cheap, that upgrade, isn't that incredible? Skellies go to Skeleton Warriors. Yeah. No, oh, well, that's not actually too bad. That's not too bad. Except, yeah. Let's swap armies. Randley, you're going to be the guy carrying that chest around now, I think. Here you go, my queen. Your army. Excellent. You will be well rewarded for this. Oh, and this thing. Do you want this? I do not know what this contraption does. Nevertheless, I shall take it. So the army is looking better. If Merist looks the same as she did before, I'm happy. But... This surely isn't right that I'm supposed to go up and get this and waste a whole two days of mucking around. Alright. Don't have time for this, no? Not really, I don't think, no. Contact lens playing up here, sorry. Oh, this is long ago. Trodden paths. Right, I'm going to go and try and make a headache for Maris now. So that's him. That's them. Oh, Randley, how did you still have 21 skeleton warriors? <laughs> After all that. <laughs> I tried so hard to make that work. Oh. Uh, well, I could get, yeah, I could get you the 21. I could get them to you, I suppose. There's nothing else. Well, I might, I might follow in your footsteps. Get up into here. What, what's Pyre doing? We've got 10 grand, so we could say to Fafna, look, Faf. So I think I'm going to do it. I don't have much else to spend. It's day two, and I've got 10 grand. I don't have much else to spend my money on. I think the reason I can do this is the extra bonus cash that came out on the water. I'm going to give this a try. Which means I have a little bit of time to uh, just do get a couple of quick scouts off here. So we want to just check. 
Yeah, she's spending the night. She's going to die behind the walls, but that's okay. <laughs> I can't get to the windmill. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to tempt fate here. Oh, I probably could tempt fate a little bit here. Okay, that uses 100. I'll have 200 remaining. It says I can do it, so I'm going to do it. Trust the numbers. Trust the numbers. <laughs> All right, Fafner, if you want this, I'm going to make you pay for it. Okay, castle is up. Escape tunnel would have been good. Is there an escape tunnel? Hasn't been built, Malwa. All right, I'm probably not going to have enough money for everything. The thing I want most is probably these. I guess orcs are okay. I don't know. How much HP do these things have? What do I do? Right click. Health 10 for 100 bucks each. Health 5 for 40 bucks each. So these are better value for money in terms of meat. I need 1200. I'm gonna go ahead and buy them. Trade off the mercury. It's fine for now. It's okay. It's not a great price, but it's all right. There's one left, I'll just buy him. Go on. That's it, that's all I need. Oof, oof, okay. Okay, I've got too many troop types. Missed that. Yeah, we'll do that. I think I'm happy with this layout. I mean, we're, 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 she's not gonna live. She's never bought a spell book before. How many spell points do you have, love? Just ten. And... So, she could learn two magic arrows, one lightning bolt. It's just not worth it, right? Doing a bunch more training. She does know Dispel. Yeah, this is okay. Alright. Fafna, bring it forth. Red. Blue, tan, green. Green, you've got no ideas left. That's your problem. Yeah, just get back in the boat and go away. If you're not going to fight me in the open, just go sail around and waste your life. Alright, so this is on. Let's not apply the battle result. Okay, um, I didn't get to choose. It just put me behind the walls and killed everything that was behind. I was trying to remember how that that, that works. Um, so that's an important thing to remember. In any case, it doesn't make any difference because I would have um, still done the same configuration. Now, what have we got? In, sorry, I mean, we still would have got rid of the imps. Yeah, let's do what the AI would do. Let's do what the AI would do. Do this for the first turn. And um, we'll go for these guys in the next turn. Okay, that stinks. Then again, expert ballistics. Right, who can get through? You can't get there, you can't get there. No, you can't do it. So I could put a bird here and just, but then the Nagas get to do their thing. Why would I let that happen? He could haste, I suppose, which would be annoying if he hasted a dude in through here. Yeah, but let's force him to do that. Yeah, so he doesn't have... he didn't do it. I think he would have cast haste if he could have there. Okay, who's going to die first to the Nagas? Maybe this guy? Yeah. Keep him handy, but I don't want to get in the way. So one, two, three, four, five. Dog stand there. Why don't you come to here? So that turn one, um, turn one gate opening is just means that we're utterly, utterly crushed. There's just no hope for us. Oh, we kill them. That'd be great. Okay, you come to here. Wow, they killed two. That's pretty good. 
Okay, so Fafner's got some form. All right, okay, I see you. I see what you're doing there. The orcs aren't in danger yet. I can't see behind that hex. <laughs> Can you get there? Can you get to that hex? Oh, I'll have to count. Nine, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think you can, yes. But you can't get to the one that's next to it, so I'll go here. And now these guys are probably a bit more of a priority. Then again, if I'm trying to inflict as much of a headache on him for the future... There's no good, yeah. There's just no good place to go. Wow, they all died, Jesus. All right. Um, hey, thought we were bros. Expert haste. All right, Fafner. Yeah, okay, well, you've done pretty good. I'm actually pretty impressed. Um, right, yeah, so just kill a few more of these guys for me. See, attack 13 is is very, very strong as well. I'm ha I, I think I'm okay with this. I think it was worth the 5, 10 grand to kill... to kill that many soldiers. It was not worth it at all. I think that was a mistake. It does stop him buying those soldiers, though. Um, and developing further, like he's just got Fafner, that's that's his asset in the area. Do I know that area? Oh, this is interesting. I might just do a little scouting before I decide to land in this strange world. Yeah, Pyre abandons my cause, so that's the end of that. Okay. I think that was a mistake. To try to... Oh, there's nothing in it to try to hold there. Um, sticky. Worth having a look up through here. Might be. There's not much else for me to do all the way up through here, is there? Okay, what else? So, Septiana. She's missing 20 skellies, but actually, I think maybe we could use these for a bit more Navigation. Let's let's do this first. So decent. Come on, jets and keep it up. Love it. Nimbus, you're doing well for me, man. You're doing very well for me. Very happy with you. Do we want to give her this? I think the answer is yes, because I've got time, right? I could pop down under here. I've got time. I've got time. Here. It's cause is it cause I couldn't see the two? Oh man, I couldn't see the little two there. That's why that happened. Come on. Alright, well he's gotta go study the arts of magic anyway, Ranlu. Do that on the way and then go to the well on the way. Yes, 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 that's right. Start with power, then do that, hit the thingy, come back. That's good. Oh nag. Wait a second, I have something for you. Ugh. This displeases me. Nagash. Alright, come on, Septiana. We need a big win. We need you to crush Tan and then carry on. Kill Fafna. Fun question, which way? <laughs> I've forgotten which way it is. It's this way. Isn't it? Surely it's this way. It's this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. <laughs> uh, I'd love to do that. We're serious. There's undead guarding it, not the fortress. That could be very good. If she can't get back in time, that could be very good for us. Nagash, if you come with me, 
we can anticipate what's going to happen. Let's actually go do that. That's worth doing. Ten ore, yeah. Okay. Lost the stronghold and we lost all the money that we made out on the uh, water. But we killed a few of these guys. Ugh, just okay, right? It's not very good. It's not very good. Okay, I'm not spending anything. Can't rehire Pyre. Let's see what happens here. Let's see what Tan can do to defend. Doesn't look like much. Anarian, you're a moron. Orange, yeah, that's... Is that just Vitamina mucking around? No, that's Vitamina there. Don't care about any of this. This is fine, by the way. Do you guys want to fight each other? Do -do 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 -do. Great! Alagar's here. Hopefully you two stare each other down. Yeah, look at that. He's hiding. Okay, nice. That's fine. Septiana. Looks like the town's ours. Okay. Lessed cover of darkness. Will we just do this? This should be an easy fight. Doesn't look like there's any hero here. I don't have visions. Yeah, there's not even a defending, defending hero here. Okay, so... We've caught Merist off step. Never upset a Dread Knight. Oh, I don't know. Um, go for them, I guess. We don't. There's no point doing the ground attack thing because see how it doesn't work. The peripheral part doesn't work. Let's see if we they want to. Do anything? Do you guys want to do anything? How far can you move? Eight. One, two, three, four. Eight. I could have teleported him, I guess. Or him. Okay, so I can get to you now with one of them. So I think I will teleport the zombies. Oh, nice. So zombies are a good stack to um, plan to animate dead on, like if they can just soak up a bunch of damage. This seems fine. So this stack and the zombies are the two that are, are struggling. What is their problem? They've got weakness. Okay. Let's do this first. Um... Then this, I think I kind of want to start animating now. That's just fantastic. Yep. That just means both stacks. A nice easy time of things. Yeah, see that's a risk. He's down to 20 HP and that doesn't come back. So if the whites attack the Vampire Lord, I'm going to be really sad. They probably are though, right? Like, why would they attack anything else? Damn. I lost two? Oh, that's so annoying. quite a lot here if I do that the turn ends. Damn. Two vampires for 12 spell points, but it's not just that either. I need 
need to raise back zombies. Who I've lost far too many of to not animate, so I'm, I know I'm doing that. Teleporting zombies seem good. They seem stronger than I remember. The vamps are here anyway. Yeah, and then I can choose to end the game next turn. Yeah. I'm probably letting the two zombies go, right? Because, yeah, well, at least they're hitting the right stack for me. To, yeah, that's good. If they'd, you know, if they'd hit the vamps, that would have been really bad. Um, I'm just going to let them go. I'm going to let them go. I'm not going to overthink it. Uh, I don't want to spend a whole night here. Um... And waste. Uh, it's not waste, but I can't guarantee that I'm going to get to spend the 12 spell points on the Vamp Lords and have nothing else go wrong. So that's not happy. Not happy about that. But uh, anyway. Advanced Earth or Advanced Logistics? Both are fantastic. Well, Logistics is half as good as I'm used to, so <laughs> if it's close, I'll go for the... And that's super annoying. These guys come back as basic skellies, but I couldn't be in a better place to sort that out. So let's have a look. <gasps> Is that a fifth level mage guild? Let's have a look. Ooh. Meteor shower. Great. Great. And clone is awesome for us. We can clone the liches. We can clone the vampire lords. <laughs> and then sacrifice, sadly. Like I've said in another video, I don't know how to use that spell. I just don't know how to do it. Um, I've got Animate Dead. I'm not going to be raising anyone up with Sacrifice instead. Research is underway and the current spell is Dispel. So this is this research thing. So the AI knows how to use the research. Cool. I love that. Oh, I just saw it in the corner. There it is. There it is. The very last thing she needs down here is slow, and then if this was implosion, we'd be, we'd be very, very happy. But this is huge. Getting blind is massive. That's excellent, except Jenna. Very, very happy. Now, there are no dudes to buy here. Um, and we don't know where Merist is. So we're going to want to re-scout this area. Um, okay, let's come back to this problem. Let's go out to the water first, see what uh, Nimbus can do for us. This guy's just been printing value. Legend. I love you, Nimbus. Ranlu was going to do this. Oh, hang on. Sorry, I meant to get the knowledge and then fill up at the well. I got the spell power instead. I don't want to learn archery. He's the one with the chest. Yeah. Well, you may as well do this job now. Okay, Stig's out on the water. Do I want to just land here and have a walk around? Yeah, it seems okay. I'll probably get killed by somebody, but... Tromping through this terrain with zombies isn't very good. Gee. I might just stay in the water. Aha. Well, well, well. Tan is here. This is their home base. So get off the coast, will you, please? <laughs> they don't like us. Alright, uh, so how did you connect all the way down to here? How did that happen? These are warriors. Okay, well then do this. While we're looking around. And just start looking around now with both heroes. 
Just come down and start exploring, man. If you get killed by Marist, that's okay. I need this area scouted. I will go... This way. You come this way. Aha. Okay, I forgot that, that was there. Yeah, if she comes back and jumps behind the walls again, that is going to be really annoying, but I can't do much about it. It's just got to be. Can she go there? She can't actually go there, so that's... Where are you? Wherever she is, she's a long way from here. Unless she's in down here, but... And she could be, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. So they've got grey unearthed upgrade. No, hang on, I'm in the wrong place. Wrong place, this one. Should I upgrade the graveyard so that... Yeah, oh, I should have been doing that too. Yeah, let's just do this, right? Definitely. Necromancy Amplifier, there's just no... Doubt that that's a good investment. Uh, yeah. We're really in no man's land in terms of scouting because of the stupid cover of darkness. I don't know where Marist is. If she's sitting here laughing, waiting to come in and hide behind the walls, I'm gonna be really mad. I'm gonna be disappointed. Perhaps the way I would characterise it. You never went there. Yeah, that was right. There was gnolls up there or gremlins. I remember doing that. There's some something there. <sighs> Problem is, the town's not very well developed. I was hoping it would be stronger than this. I'm going to need to try to sort of build a campaign where I defend both towns, get a supply chain going between them, and then try to take the conflux. Everything from this town gets fed back to the base to be upgraded. But Walking Dead will not be. Yeah, I'm definitely upgrading that graveyard. Okay. Ugh. I don't know if I've spoken to you guys about um, the template. Something worth mentioning. You might all be thinking if only it had, had Town Portal. I'll have to go back and check the previous video episodes or whatever of the campaign if I've explained it yet but this map um, for this template for Horn of the Abyss I have switched off Town Portal because I'm challenging myself to not play an endgame where I'm just town portaling around everywhere like Septiana just town portaling all over the place and killing everybody so I've switched it off which means I can't learn it I don't know what happens if you find the Tome of Earth Magic I'm not sure how that works or a, but I think there's no such thing as a scroll of Town Portal and you can't it won't show up in the Mage Guilds and then um, I've also switched off Eagle Eye and Diplomacy so even though I've switched off Eagle Eye heroes that naturally have it will still have it but you can't learn it and then it's the same with Diplomacy so you can even in the templates ban the hero like I could have deleted Nimbus from the pool of heroes as well this is the power of Horn of the Abyss, the editor, the template editor. It just gives so much um, so much utility. Alright, quick look at what Green's up to. He's off in a boat somewhere again, mucking around, wasting time, which is great. It's exactly where we want him. Alright, let's see what's going on. on, on of, can we defend this? What? Where is Marist? She hasn't shown her face. Okay. Green really is treading water. They're going nowhere. Orange, orange seems to be like it's the best. I'd love you two to fight each other. Is it too much to ask? Obviously, yes. G. Keep exploring. Let's just have a scout here. See what you can find out for me. About their town. Oh, that's right. If you get too close to the coast, it does that. Uh-oh. There's Marist. Hello, my darling. Well, if you're out there, 
10 to 19, so there's a pack of Chaos Hydras now. Lots of Mighty Gorgons. She is looking pretty formidable. The safest thing uh, I can do is actually land here. You can't fight me. And uh, just run you around the wrong way. Scout your base. That's fantastic news. She's so out of position. She's profoundly out of position. That's really, really good. So... Right. I kind of feel like I should have hired another hero here immediately. I'm an idiot for not doing that. Could have been out today running around doing stuff. I guess this is the man. This fellow. Aiden? Comes running down here. Let's just check out what's upstairs first. Right. Alright, let's just get some scouts. We need these scouts. We need to expand our frontage. Of our knowledge. How many skills do you have? You don't even have any. You might just do this for your own good. Um, yeah. I love ballistics. Can't say no to it. Oh, that connects there. Okay. What's that thing there? A trading post? That could be good. Get some crystal. Mineral spring? I don't know what that does. This could just be a neutral area. Will I hire Aiden? So, Septiana, really, I'd love to come here next with her, if it's safe, which I think it is now. We've narrowed your way out of position, babe. <laughs> How do I get to that portal, though? It's here ish. Okay, what is that thing? Seer's hut. Yeah, I think she's come the wrong way. Yeah, I was hoping I can connect up to it through there, but I don't think I can. So, come back down. Um, I'm just going to hire him, and he can just start running around. See what you can find out, man. Oh, you want to take all these with you? Take them. Have that army. Sniff that other dog's butt. Dude, I know I'm doing that. There's no way I'm dragging Walking Dead all the way back to my other base. Right, just come on. Let's be sensible at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'd love to get this. Do I get this? Stay five. Oh! <laughs> I think this is safe. The next, the next closest thing is you go up, up around here. There's an orange portal here back to Fafna, but he's got to worry about this guy. Both of these are killable with Septiana. So if green, we can just keep green off our backs. Dude, look at that, Demon's Horseshoe. Oh, I can imagine what it does. Negative luck, yeah, is a thing in this game now. Just so cool. Yeah, cool. I love negative luck. I like that. I love the idea that they fixed that properly. Right, Nimbus, 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 Nimbus. Give me stuff. Come to here. Get this. Oh, there's nothing in the flotsam. Mm, okay. Right, I think dinner is calling, so I'll be back. Ups and downs. Lost a stronghold, gained a necro. Might be able to hold it. Marist out of position. Good news for us.